They've played a lot of different players. They're not quite there personnel-wise, but Crawley is a guy who I think gives them some hope that there's better days ahead. He's handled himself well, called into duty as their two starting corners are out. Right. Second down and seven. And immediately was DeAnthony Thomas and Crawley coming up to make the play. Crawley, the rookie corner, coming up to make the play. You put your corners in run support. Willing tackler, cor tackling corners like Crawley in run support could be a long day for this Chargers offense. 20 yard line. Rabbit steps up, throws, and Shepard again. There is a flag. Shepard makes the catch of the 15. Palmer right side, a quick tunnel screen. Looks like it's David Johnson on the reception. Third and goal. Listen to this place. Wilson gets it out to Lockett, who gets wrapped up by Ken Crawley. Beautiful job by Crawley. We've been getting on him a little bit, but here's where you eliminate thought. And right there, Crawley does a great job of not looking back at the quarterback. The biggest mistake that man coverage people make is they look back at the quarterback, then the receiver starts to pull away, and Crawley with an open field tackle. Saints rush just three. Rivers steps up and throws to the left side. It's Gordon who's taken down immediately after a short game beyond the 25 to the 26 yard line. The pass to Tyler Lockett. Lockett is met there right away by Ken Crawley. In motion and joining him in a stack formation at the near side of the field is Cruz. Here's the pass to Cruz who runs it down the near side. Line. Stays in bounds inside the 30. Making a move at the 20. The ball is charred free. And the Saints have covered it at the 16-yard line. Crawley knocked the ball out from behind. So the rookie free agents combine to get the ball back for the Saints. Cruz to the near side of the field has been quiet. The Saints rush Manning, who flush from the pocket. He throws downfield for Cruz, and Cruz can't bring it in. Crawley did a nice job on coverage. The ball was well thrown, but Cruz couldn't collar it at the 30-yard line. Well, Crawley did a great job of just staying with the play. You know, you thought the official was going to bail him out for not getting his head around as far as once the ball is thrown. But uh, Cruz got away with a little push there, and uh, great no call. Of Rivers on first and 10 from the 25. Play action to him. Double clutch, and it's broken down nicely and broken up by Ken Crawley. And they're coming again. Pressure up the middle, and he throws, and that is broken up, intended for Funches, and broken up by Ken Crawley, rookie out of Colorado. Well, you can't do it any better than that if you're Cam Newton. You basically bust their blitz. You saw it. You let your offensive line know exactly what it was, and they still ended up getting pressure. Second and nine at the 46. Bootleg left by Ryan. Ryan stops and throws, coming back with the football incomplete through the hands of his intended receiver, Taylor Gabriel, as he was working his way back to the football and uh, Ken Crawley yeah, on Ken the Crawley, coverage. Ken Crawley did a great job, but what really forced Ryan to have to go down the field, Ken Crawley was able to really just drive on that football. And a four-man rush. Newton fires over the middle, and that's dropped at the 48-yard line by Benjamin. That is a heck of a defensive play right there. I believe that's Ken Crowley, right? Yep. Wow, what a big play and a big moment for a backup guy. The rush throws, and Benjamin did not hold on. Incomplete. Hard throw by Cam Newton. He's hung in there. Calvin Benjamin on the outside. There's the first window running through to the second window. You're leading him in to the potential for a big hit. Take the check down. Off the line is Newton. Off the play fake to Stewart. He wants to go deep, and there it goes. Up top, and the pass hits the defender in the back. Ken Crawley, the defender, was covering. Ken Ginn Jr. on the play. Receives as well in this passing game. Third down and six. Panthers must get to the 22. This is Samuel. And he is met immediately by Ken Crawley, who you mentioned inactive the first two weeks in the starting lineup for the Saints today. Oh, he's got a lot of qualities that the Saints like, and this is well bred. Watch him try.
trigger, get past Russell Shepard, make a great tackle. I mean, it is Allen's defense. Corners have to be able to tackle on the edge. You've got it right there. Good play by that young corner. Dennis Allen telling us yesterday Crawley has good speed. We saw it there. He did start five games for the Saints last year. From the 34-yard line on second and one. Newton's pass broken up. Ken Crawley makes the play. Pass intended for Funches. Crawley quietly having a good day. Not quietly, actually. He's making a bunch of big plays. And I think it's hard for a guy that's been sitting on the sideline to come in and have to play right away. But he's clearly ready for his opportunity today. On second down and seven. Newton's pass nearly picked off. It's Crawley again. He's had a strong game this afternoon. This is just great coverage. And I gotta be honest with you, it's, it's a even better job by Bird. This is gonna be an interception. Cam Newton puts this ball right in the chest of Ken Crawley and Bird everywhere. Here's Niles Paul has missed the last two games and Crawley with a strong tackle. And running back for the Falcons. And to the left, open field. Good form tackle by Ken Crawley. No timeouts left for Carolina. Here's Olsen. And with that tackle, that keeps the clock running. Good, strong tackle by Crawley. Bryce Petty at the controls. Outside he goes for the rookie Hanson, who is drilled on the play by Crawley. 25. Cam, a quick throw to Kalen Clay. Wrapped up by Crawley. Before he was hurt. Is caught. McKinnon is wrapped up by Crawley. And a good open field stop by Ken Crawley to force fourth down. That's really good because he's able to recognize the combination. And when McKinnon comes to the flat, Crawley immediately then goes and attacks it. Sack twice. Over the middle, McCaffrey swallowed up immediately. Crawley was there to bring him down. Ryan rolling right, looking, looking, taking off these slides. And converting these chances into touchdowns. Tossed to Stewart running left. Nothing. Anya Mata was out there and Kent Crawley as well. Fourth down and six. Play action, pass to the sideline, it's caught. Depends on what they give him for progress. Funches. He didn't get it. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't, didn't look to me like he got it either. And Good tackle out there by Ken Crawley. Yeah, it was press coverage, and so pushing up and pushing up far enough to where when you catch it, you're beyond the sticks is is really the, the discipline that you have to show. That's a great job by Crawley, you know, riding him and then, then making the play. But, boy, that is really disheartening when... You complete a pass. Five yard line of the Lions. Quick throw near sideline. Tate taken down quickly by the Saints. Newton and first down on the slant. Drive. Matthew Stafford, as we talked about, not quite 100% physically as the first play of the game for him is going to be an incomplete pass. Looking for Marvin Jones. Can Crawley on the coverage there? Stafford out of his own end zone, off the hands of Marvin Jones. Ken Crawley there in coverage. Looked like he got his left arm in there to bat that away. Play clock in two, they get it off. Cutler, a lot of time, throw far side, and incomplete. Boy, Ken Crawley, who had the interception earlier, was right in the mix again. And it was intended for Devontae Parker. If there's one thing that's really improved in Ken Crawley's game, it's confidence. After his rookie season, remember he was an undrafted free agent last year. Ended up starting five games in 2016. All right, he had 10 passes broken up. Forget the stats. He realized he could play in the NFL. Trubisky on the play action. Threw him all the way across the field, a dangerous pass. And that was broken up by Ken Crawley. Intended for Tanner Gentry. It's a dangerous pass in the sense that there's no separation created between Gentry 
in Crawley. You have to drive Crawley off the ball. You have to get his shoulders turned. You have to get him out of his back pedal. He barely got out of his back pedal, so he was able to make a tremendous break on the ball. The biggest story of the week in the NFL to the sideline. Funches made the catch, but out of bounds. Defended by Ken Crawley. Trubisky throws. Incomplete. Ken Crawley was there on the coverage of Trey McBride. There's just no room to throw the ball. Crawley right here is bouncing back after a tough game last week. Does an outstanding job in coverage again. Not getting pushed off and undercuts the underthrown ball by Trubisky. Can't expect to score touchdowns to keep up with that offense. On second and six, here's Doxson. It is incomplete. Ken Crawley was there. Looked like he had his hands on it. Doxson took it away at the end, and they rule it incomplete along the boundary. Let's take another look. Yeah, initially it looked like Crawley might have intercepted it, but this That's is the 50-50 ball. You see Crawley's in great position, but Doxson pulls it away from him. The ball obviously incomplete. That's for Sean Payton. They found something with the young talent. Right. Shot. Incomplete. Crawley had his hands on it. The pass was intended for Marvin Hall, the first year receiver. One of the things that impresses you when you put on the tape of Crowley here is that he knows how to play. Watch him get his head around right there. Still had a feel at the wide receiver. Goes up and did everything absolutely perfectly. Tackles. He's a tough little guy. Second and seven. Newton slings it to the end zone. A lot of hand checking and Olsen the target. No flag. Ken Crawley was back there covering and neither one gets up and complains. One of those 50-50 balls and, and give him a chance. It's a lot of hand checking as you said. But, you know, as much on Greg Olsen as And the catch, no. Evans simply dropped it, it looked like. But Crawley does not quit on it and is able to strip it as he comes to the ground. Crawley's been a nice addition. You mentioned that, Tom. You're exactly right. He's been a good pickup for them and Dennis Allen. Great protection and incomplete. The 24. It's Ryan looking to go to Sanu and a big battle and an incomplete pass there. Crawley was right on Sanu. And how about the officials letting them work it out themselves too? Watch Sanu number 12 in white against Crawley number 20 in black. And they're hand fighting with each other. And that ball ends up hitting Crawley in the back of his head. And I know Atlanta fans are screaming for interference here. But the officials have told us consistently, if they see hands on both sides working against each other, they'll let you work it out on your own. Third and three. Right. One man left to suppress him. He's going to throw it far south. It's going to be even if he was going for Gabriel. It was Crawley on the coverage. And Atlanta on fourth down will obviously go. Watch Crawley number 20 in coverage against Gabriel. And he turns his back to him, but he watches Gabriel react, and he really swallowed the ball out with his size. From the buck 35, here's Winston quickly throwing out to the right side. Catch made and wrestled down right around the 40-yard line. The block by Beecher. Incomplete intercepted on the play by Robertson. On the deflection, and he's off to the races and brought down on the play by Forte. Interception by Petty. Pick off by Robertson. That is his first of the season. And the New Orleans Saints will celebrate as they've got it in Jet Territory. These guys love playing football. They have fun. We talked about this young secondary. Ken Crawley, he comes screaming and over the top. He's the one that initially makes the play. He's going to come in over the top. He gets his hands on the football. Deflects it right up in the air into the waiting arms of the linebacker, Craig Robertson. Not the Saints have had the ball. Color's going to loft it to Thomas in the corner. Intercepted! What a play by Ken Crawley. He played it beautifully. 
roughly, and that drive ends with nothing. How about Ken Crawley here? Because he's small, right? Ken Crawley's going against a tight end. Crawley, 6'1", 180, was more physical than the 6'5", 262-pound Julius Thomas. Never let him off the line of scrimmage, never let him get past him, and ends up going up and picking off the first pass of the game.